Hello and welcome to IFS YouTube videos. My name is Jerry Browning and I'm the product manager for enterprise asset management at IFS. In this video we're going to create a fault report and attach a task template to it. First we're going to overview a task template to replace a proximity switch on an injection molding machine. Then we're going to create a new fault report walking through the fault report wizard in IFS. Once created, we're going to open the work order and attach the task template we discussed in the beginning. Then we're going to release the template so it shows up in the technician's queue. First, let's go to the task template. Okay, in this work task template, it's designed to, to replace a prox sensor on the injection molding machine. If we go to a work list here, we can see that the duration should take us an hour, and we can see basic steps that it takes to replace it. It also shows the resource groups and the material, which is a prox sensor. Now that we have an overview of, of what the task template looks like, let's create a fault report on an injection molding machine. Now if we go back home, go down to maintenance, go to work management, initiation, this is where we find our new fault report wizard. We'll start by entering the object and grab injection molding machine number two. Next, we're going to select a maintenance org and a directive, which is replace proximity sensor, and then the fault description. And let's, we can pick, go ahead and pick a discovery code. And the symptom is a unexpected stop. Priority, we're going to say we need immediate action on this guy. And we're going to go ahead and finish it. All right, now we've created the fault report and it's generated work order number 202939. Let's look at the work order. So now that we're on the work order, we're going to go down to jobs and templates, do a new. Now we'll enter a task template ID. And save. All that's left to do is go to the work task. And we'll change the status to released. So now this work order is in queue for any maintenance technician with a resource of mechanic to be able to pick up and start working on it. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to our IFS YouTube channel.